Our first theorem is that two lines intersect at at most one point. We'll call it theorem 0 0.001. Now the numbering system for these theorems is arbitrary. It doesn't matter what you call it. You don't really have to number them at all. I just think it'll be easier to go back and reference them later. So this I'm going to number this one. So it states that two lines intersect at uh, at most one point. So even though we only have uh, two axioms, we can actually prove this theorem based off those two axioms alone. And then we'll use this theorem to prove other theorems and so on. So we're going to do this proof by contradiction. All right. The way we're going to do this is we're going to say suppose there exists two lines, so exists two lines And let's name them L sub 1 and L sub 2. Which we already know there exist two lines. Suppose that they intersect. So suppose they intersect in two or more points. In two or more points. So let's see what this would look like so far. Let's go to green for this, I guess. So this will be L sub 1 and L sub 2 would have to intersect it in two or more points, so say that is L sub 2. I should probably uh, probably have L sub 1 going on forever since it is a line. Alright, so we have two lines and they intersect at two or more points. Well, then we can say, we'll write then out, then there exists two points A and B such that AB, so there exists two points A and B such that AB is a element of L sub 1 intersect L sub 2. So L sub 1 intersect L sub 2. Let's label our two points. We'll have point A over here. A, and we'll make B purplish. Really not sure what to call this color. Well, then we can say that then a and B are elements of L sub 1. Also, A and B are elements, so are elements of L sub 2. Then by our first axiom, or er, well, our second axiom, which is axiom 1. So by axiom 1, L sub 1 equals L sub 2. So L sub 1 and L sub 2 are the same line. 
So I wasn't going to do a spy contradiction, but decided that I think it would make a little bit more sense this way part way through. So our, our proof, we suppose that there are two lines, L sub 1 and L sub 2. We have both of those. And they intersected two or more points. We only care about two of the points of intersection. So it, there could have been a third point of intersection out here, point C, and we could have done A and C, but it, it doesn't matter. All we needed was two points. Then, uh, because they're on each line, they must be part of each line, but by axiom one, those two lines must be the same line. So we are done with the proof, and we'll do that right there to show that we're done.